Myopia is the medical term for short-sightedness, where the eyeball is uh, too big, too long, or too powerful. Um, people with myopia can see clearly close up, but they struggle to see in the distance. Uh, and they wear minus glasses. So I'm minus five, so if I take my glasses off, uh, you're pretty blurry, but I can see up close as long as I get it in, in tight, it's okay. Once you start going short-sighted, you generally find that the prescription declines or increases over time, and that happens between the key ages of about six to age about 20. How would I know if my child has myopia? Well, the most important thing is to make sure you get your child's eyes examined every couple of years from the age of about four or five. But if there's any concerns or a family history of eye conditions at a young age, you should bring them in at any age from birth. Children might complain of the television being a bit blurry, the whiteboard being a bit blurry at school, the teacher or you may notice them screwing up their eyes to try and see a bit more clearly, um, complaining of headaches, struggling to concentrate, falling behind at school. All these can be signs of vision problems that should be investigated. Why does it matter? What's wrong with just wearing glasses? Glasses are cooler than they've ever been. Does it really matter? It's not that big a deal being short-sighted, is it? Well, if a child is short-sighted, then they're at risk of deterioration, which means reliance on thicker and thicker, stronger glasses, and all the problems that that causes at school and with sports and so on. But the real problem is later in life, because being myopic puts you at a high risk of eye disease, cataract, glaucoma, macular degeneration, retinal detachment, all much increased when you're short-sighted. But there is something that can be done to slow the progression of myopia, and that is myopia management. So myopia management aims to slow the progression of myopia in kids by up to 50% uh, using specialised contact lenses. And we're one of only a, a handful of practices in the country with the expertise and experience to be given access to these latest lenses. Um, and they aim to reduce the progression of myopia by up to 50%. There are kind of two options, two ways of doing this. You have harder lenses that you can wear overnight when sleeping, kind of like a dental retainer, so you take them out during the day. And then you have daily disposable, a daily disposable option for wearing during the day. Um, and both these correct the myopia, so the vision is clearer, but also provide the effect to reduce the progression of myopia through the teens. We aim to slow the progression of myopia as much as possible during the teens so that you have a lower prescription when you get to adulthood uh, and that means uh, not so strong glasses but also means a much lower risk of um, eye disease in later life and so this really matters and it really works so don't just let your children's myopia increase like yours maybe did or like mine did through my teens and um, just sort of watching and hoping there is now something you can do uh, and you can find out much more information on our website or come and see us uh, and we'll talk you through all the options